Well, former New York City Mayor Michael Bloomberg is already revealing a willingness to break from the Democratic pack as he takes a step to run for president. On Friday, his advisor said Bloomberg plans to skip campaigning in the first four states to vote and focus initially on the 15 states participating in Super Tuesday on March the 3rd. This is the billionaire qualified to get on the ballot in one of those Super Tuesday states, Alabama. Here's Ed O'Keefe. Former Mayor Mike Bloomberg kept a low profile on Friday as his aides turned in paperwork in Alabama, the state with the earliest filing deadline. And there are plans to do so in other states next week. But would-be Democratic opponents believe Bloomberg should spend his billions some other way? I think it's a savagely broken system uh, that people who have wealth can somehow uh, leapfrog others who might be as viable or more viable candidates. Senator Elizabeth Warren welcomed him to the race by tweeting out a link to her billionaire's calculator showing what he'd owe in taxes if she's president. The mayor previously said he'd stay out of the race because of former Vice President Joe Biden's commanding lead over the field. All right, where do I sign, boss? But the former Veep, who filed his own presidential paperwork in New Hampshire, is falling behind Warren and Bernie Sanders in some polls. Biden says Bloomberg needn't worry. And in terms of uh, he's running because of me, I, last polls I looked at, I'm pretty far ahead. And then there's a fellow New Yorker with a strong opinion, President Trump. But he doesn't have the magic to do well. There is nobody I'd rather run against than little Michael, that I can tell you. As a former Republican and Independent, Bloomberg would fight for climate change, revamping the nation's schools and gun control, issues that are sure to make him popular with Democrats. But he does face an uphill climb. In a poll just last month, only 6% of likely Democratic primary voters said they would definitely vote for the former mayor if he runs for president. For CBS This Morning Saturday, Ed O'Keefe, Washington.